I'm Jim Martin. I'm the District Attorney of Lehigh County. We're going to make a brief statement. I'd like you all to appreciate the fact that this is a ongoing investigation. We're not going to have a lot of answers to questions which you may have. So with that, I'll introduce the people who are arrayed behind me. To the far left is Nathan Bernoski, who's with Penn State State Police. Chief Mike Satoski in the upper uh, McKenzie Township Police Department. Chief County Detective Lou Tallarico, who runs the Homicide Task Force in the county. Lieutenant Matt Trembo, PSP. Lehigh County's partner, Eric Miller. Okay, around uh, at about 4.48 a.m. this morning, a uh, shots fired complaint was called in to Upper Mukipendi Township Police through the county. Uh, what we have determined by investigation to this point is that the white Corolla vehicle, which you see parked facing generally in a uh, south direction, uh, had an encounter with a vehicle on Route 22 uh, near or between the intersections of Route 309 and uh, Cedar Crest Boulevard. Um, there was a female driving a white vehicle uh, in that vicinity. Uh, a shot was fired at that vehicle by presumably the driver of the white Corolla. Uh, that woman was not injured. Uh, she did not realize that she had uh, that her vehicle had been shot upon until she came here, which we believe was pure happenstance or coincidence. She came here to get a, a sandwich, and when she came out of the Wawa, she realized that there was a bullet hole in her car. She did say that she had heard a loud bang. She's in the process of being interviewed as we speak. Um, the driver of the white Corolla pulled in here and went around to the other side of the Wawa, which would be generally the southerly side of it. There was a Jeep vehicle there which was occupied by its driver. He was shot. Uh, he's receiving treatment now. It does not appear that his injuries are life-threatening, uh, but he was shot and injured. After that, the driver of the white Corolla fired upon the truck driver of that tractor who was pumping gas. He has been killed, unfortunately. Um, thereafter, the driver of the white Corolla uh, ran south on Route 100, about a quarter mile away, and uh, it appears that he committed suicide by shooting himself uh, in the hand and in the chest. Uh, we don't have identities like that. We, we have some identities, but the next of kin have not been notified. That will happen uh, through the coroner's office, and uh, I'm not prepared at this point to release the identities of any of the people, including the shooter. Uh, the matter is continuing under investigation. Uh, there are some peripheral areas within Lehigh County where there is a police response at the moment uh, investigating uh, this incident further to see if we can determine um, the involvement of the driver of the Corolla. Uh, we don't have any motive at this point. It appears that uh, the shooting, the three shootings that I have described uh, have been indiscriminate and unrelated. I, but I caution that I'm saying that it appears at this time that that is the case.